and gentlemen, welcome to Logical Heroes. I'm Mitch, aka Robacus. I'm Trevor. And today we got the series, season series finale of Obi Wan. I think it's a series. Um, I don't think yeah. there's another season two. I don't think there's gonna be a season two, so we're gonna nah, just gonna call nah, it a nah, series. Nah, nah. It's just a series uh, finale. Super excited to see how they're gonna try and finish off this series. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, whichever, what do you think about it so far? Give like a five, a ten second thing. What do they uh, need to make this work? Underwhelming, it's been. Uh, okay. Like I feel like again, Disney's using the the big names, the the past like movies to hype us up mm -hmm. and kind of blind us with the Star Wars like nature of it. We're like, yeah, this is awesome. It's so cool to see. But then they're just like not giving us what they should be giving us. We're getting yeah. like thirty percent. It feels like. And it's it's sad. Maybe I wouldn't be this critical if I never saw the show Mandalorian. Mandalorian, but like that show killed it. And it was like each episode, you you're not even thinking about. Oh, I hope the next few episodes are good. Yeah. You're like in the episode. You're like this is sick. And that's what I was expecting from this series. And that's why I think it's just struggling a lot. But All right, we won't talk too much about it because we're gonna do a little review at the end. So make sure to stay after we do our reaction to it because we're going to give about like a five to ten minute little review on what we actually think of the whole series all together because i have some things i want to say as well but do you want to give a quick recap before we start getting into the reaction uh reva got <laughs> stabbed in the stomach <laughs> thank god <laughs> Woo! i'm just not a fan of her character and i did like i wanted to see the grand inquisitor so i'm i was happy that they did that twist that he's still they alive had and, and and they're like Hey, hey, little girl, we knew what was going on that whole time. You thought you could fool us? Like me, Darth Vader? No. Yeah. So I like that. Um, but they, she stayed alive again. It's like, how many times can this <laughs> girl get stabbed die. in the stomach <laughs> by a lightsaber and come back? It's like, yeah. dude, just finish the job and then dump her in the ditch. Don't freaking <laughs> stab her and just let her crawl away. I don't get the thinking of that. No. But uh, So that happened. Um Obi-Wan got away. Uh, he did the little switcheroo on the ships and yep. got away with all the people. And we saw Darth Vader do the huge power move. Just him, like, Pulled grab the ship the down. down. But then when he saw that they switched, he was just kind of like, ah, you got me. You guys. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you darn. Guys can fly away. <laughs> and then, um, then, then we were talking about Luke. I think yes. they're trying to retrieve Luke now. So he's probably going to be in this episode. We and I'm assuming it's going to be, like, I hope it's going to be, like, finally obi-wan and darth vader they stop playing around they're like against each other yeah and obi-wan's got to pull out everything he's got to to save luke uh, leia and end the story for now <laughs> you know yeah. and but it's that's like, kind of where we left off and that's like this is an episode for me where they really gotta tie it all in and they really gotta hit you at the end of this because if you don't do you know what? I'm not even going to say it. Let's just get right into it. But before we do, guys, if you could drop a like and subscribe like down and below, it would be greatly appreciated. We're bringing you no more Obi-Wan after this, but we got a bunch of other content that we bring you guys uh, almost every day of the week. Mm -hmm. So we're not going to keep talking. We're going to get right into this. Okay, let's, where are we going with this? Positive thoughts. I just want to push over a Jawa. <laughs> Same. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the girl Mandalorian freaking sleeps with them. She dated one. Yeah. Oh, that's the guy who Obi Wan was working with. That guy. Is she already healed. Name's Owen. Man, you're a mess. What's your goal now? I just... To get Luke. I don't even know why, though. And what, she looks like she just wrapped her stomach. Yeah. Oh, I love when his cape's just flapping. Yeah. Lord Vader. Oh shit, they're still that close uh, to them. They didn't get away. No, they're all pretty calm for We'll head for Tessie. Get you out from there. 
Dude, if I had turbulence like that on a regular plane just from wind, I'd be shitting my pants. Yeah, they're all so calm. No. <laughs> We're not going to make it to Tessin, are we? Um... More than we have. <laughs> yeah, we're all gonna die in a few minutes. Jeez. And now they're getting scared. Oh, look behind you, man. Darth Vader's <laughs> shooting at you on top. <laughs> What's he gonna do, though? Yeah, seriously. Leo with no fear whatsoever. Yeah. Maybe I should borrow her too. Oh, OB. What do you need, oh. kid? We need a new belt. <laughs> Owen. Oh shit. <laughs> Already? This is probably not good. I told her everything. <laughs> no, no way! You can't just leave me here! I'm the one that they don't want. If I go, you can follow me. I'm not letting you! Leia, please. Oh my god. Fix the ship. This will give him that time. You spent ten years protecting the Jedi. Yeah, to dying. It'll buy you the time you need. You must get these people out of here. You are all the future. You are the future. You He's right. Listen See, this is more like Obi Wan. You must promise me that you get her home, Hodja, as soon as I'm in the clear. Yes, my lord. I was about to say, oh, he's serious now. <laughs> Just say okay and walk yeah. away. Listen to Obi Wan. God damn it. Oh, shite. Do you think that they told him? Like told Reva that they're there? Well, How did she know it was I think so. No, oh, I know she's coming. Venice. I'm not leaving my home. At least here we have a chance. We stay. You boy. You guys got some guns doing? or what? We both knew the stain might come. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, because she's a bitch. <laughs> I'm so done with her character right now. I hate that she's alive and still causing drama. Yeah. Not your father. <laughs> Please tell your father I... I have something to do, though. There's no, there's nothing you can do in this situation. Hmm. That's cool. Empty. Well, I wasn't going to give you a blaster, Leia. You're 10 years old. <laughs> yeah, this isn't America. <laughs> I 
<laughs> uh, I want more of him. He he does great whenever he's on. Screen. I know. Is this gonna be the end of the this like little storyline? I think, and I hope so, because we need breathing room to, so he can actually fight. If she's there, he has to worry about protecting her. Oh, shit. Let's go! Let's go. That's clean. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Do they have, like, an escape pod or something? Connect with the forest, man. I would. I said it in the first episode. I want to see Qui Gon in this. this. You know, that'd be awesome, right? Fix the drop. It's time, dude. Shut up. Just keep them safe. Has left. People follow you. Damn straight. Ice Cube's son. Now, time to go face Vanda. Uh, okay. Get amped, Obi Wan. Let's go. Ooh. -hoo. Are we gonna see it, man? And there he goes. Ah, it's cool seeing him with Darth Vader. Wipe out this network in its entirety. We cannot prioritize one lone. Follow Kenobi. Damn. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay, see, Obi Wan knew what he was doing. Maybe he has his lightsaber now. When he got rid of it at the start, where he's like, "There's other ways to fight." I'm just yeah. like, "No." <laughs> Mm, damn. Don't waste. So stay in here. If anything goes wrong, you. Oh. The... Is she really gonna try and like kill them? I don't even know why she's going after Luke. That's right. I don't know her main goal right now. It's kind of confusing. That looks cool. Like, she can't be going to get Luke because she's trying to impress Darth Vader, or like it. I will. Oh, let's go, please. That's badass. <laughs> I love him just walking down long hallways. He looks so yeah. cool. <laughs> Where are we at right now? Yeah, I know. Oh, is that Darth going down alone? Oh, they're gonna fight on this planet alone? What planet is this? She gave to him. He smashes it. Oh god. <laughs> you got this. Damn, round two. Hey, 
Keep in mind, bro. Get that high ground. It worked last time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit. Oh, that's not Darth Vader. Oh, that's Reva. <laughs> I was like, why is the head not so big? Ah, what is your purpose, girl? Everything's all happening now. I hope it doesn't do the thing where it switches back and forth between fights. Keep it with Obi Wan and <laughs> keep it Darth. here. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Getting chills. <laughs> Apes are flapping. Oh, he's waiting there too. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh my Shit. God. Are they going to talk much or is it going to just be? Oh, that's so cool looking. Have you come to destroy me? Obi Wan. <laughs> Damn. Yeah! Let's go. Then you will die. Uh. That's what they said to each other in episode three. Oh! Yeah. Shit, dude, there's no high ground here. This is a hard fight. This is some better choreography than the last fight. Yeah, this one's much better. <laughs> He's big man. Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> this is you not what I wanted. It. You called it, man. I knew they were gonna do that. We don't even know her purpose. Stop showing us this. Just snipe her and move on. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you. Whoa. Oh, that, that looks so cool. Oh. This is great. This is what I was waiting for. They still haven't even used the force. No. Oh, here we go. Thunder marks. Oh. Oh. But the weakness. Oh my god. He just tossed oh. like a whole fucking mountain. Cool. This is sick. This is sick. Don't go back to the other stuff. Oh. Please. Yeah. Oh. This is intense. Oh, oh boy. Rock slid under his feet to. Oh. And that is why you will always. I'm loving his fighting right now, Darth Vader. Oh shit, he's got the high ground. <laughs> Reverse! <laughs> oh my god. Dude. 
Hopefully he was like using the force to kind of shield a little bit. <laughs> Damn! That was cool, Mitch. Oh, he's a master too. That was cool. That was that was the choreography was great. Yeah. Oh boy. Such a shitty person. <laughs> yeah. What? What? Just kill oh my god, I'm so Jesus. What is her deal? Justice for what, though? No. Nice. Yeah. Dude. Like, what the fuck did Luke do? <laughs> I don't know, man. Ah, I'm chasing a little kid. Ah. <laughs> that made me uncomfortable. Yeah, like when she was trying to get information out of Princess Leia. Mm -hmm. like, so cringe. Yeah, he's using the force. Cool. Oh my god, it's coming in! Oh shit. Is he gonna get the strength and just blast through all the rocks with the That'd force? That'd be kinda cool. Yeah! Oh shit, just what I was thinking in my head, that was cool. <laughs> Yo, he leaped out of that pretty good. <laughs> oh, he's going after him still, it's not like he's running away again. That was a lot of rocks too, that wasn't like yeah. easy shit. Oh, Four. let's go! He's back in it, baby! Oh, behind the back? Fighting. Oh. Okay. Let's go, man. Whoa. <laughs> Fuck the dark side. This is power, baby. That's pretty badass. This is a much bigger fight than I actually expected. Yeah. This fight is how I expected. <laughs> <sighs> Poor Luke, he's like, what's going on? Yeah, seriously. Dude, it's so weird. Okay! Damn! Oh shit, dude. How is this gonna end? Fuck! <gasps> oh, he broke something. Damn, Obi-Wan's putting in work. Holy shit. Okay. We're going to see his face. 
half of it, at least that'd be cool. Really giving Obi Wan respect this episode. I loving it. I'm sure that shot's like in Clone Wars or Rebels. Oh my god, his voice. Holy shit. That's awful. That's so sad. Yeah, that's how I feel, man. That's... Ugh. You can hear, like, the kid in his voice. Uh -huh. I'm sorry, Anakin. For all of it. Jesus, he looks great, though. Like, that's fucking cool. I am not your failure. Oh, I love that. I did. Yeah. Holy shit! Look at his eyes. Oh, Jesus. his Sith eyes. I will. God. Fuck. Excellent scene. What, right? The best out of the series, for sure. Oh, he looks awesome in that. Right? That's so cool. Can't wait to see people cosplay that. Holy f He needs to go in his healing chamber. Damn! That was close to like the Darth Maul, like Obi Wan. Kenobi! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, that's so cool, that voice acting. Wow, that was crazy. And we're back to this. <laughs> That was excellent, though. That That's what right. we waited for. Uh, that was awesome. It looked like they actually cared. Yeah. That, that scene. Oh, my God. What the hell is she doing? I'm so upset with her. Hold on. Go kill her. Yes. I'm still trying to figure out what the purpose of this is. Right? Honestly, why is Darth Vader a better person than her? This is... Bro. She's trying to kill him. But why? What is her point? Get back at Obi Wan and get back at Darth. Yeah, do you see how how much of a hypocrite you are? What is going on? What, what the fuck was this? Have you ever seen that mean meme where it's like, chill daddy, and he's like, yeah. what the <laughs> fuck is even that? <laughs> yeah. I was like, just sitting there like, I just don't that? know what she's conflicting about and yeah. why it's taking her this long to like, be confused about. But why is she trying to kill Luke? I like... Yeah, I don't get it. 
He's Change your heart? That's so stupid though, I would still stab her. I decided not to kill him. Okay. Can you tell him if he's alive or not? Because this looks awful to the parents. <laughs> And shoot her in the face, do something. Ask questions like, what the fuck? Like, you didn't even, let's just say they know he's not dead. You just hurt my son. Yeah, I would be attacking her. That'd be your instinct. And I wouldn't want to be sitting that close to her. And don't say thank you, because she kidnapped him. I'm so confused by this scene. This feels like something that they just added in. Are they trying to say she's a change of heart and now she's a good person? Let's like say Scarlet Witch is a good person now. I made a mistake. You murdered people. Uh... Kill a kid? I failed him. Failed him? You just got... I'm so confused. I My showing must. Who wrote this? <laughs> up to you it was always up to you you make no sense please don't show up in the movies <laughs> I can't even hold it in anymore I hate her Does this make sense to you, though? No, okay. We'll talk about it after. We both are. Okay, back to the good story. Cool shit. Sorry for complaining. Now I'm happy. <laughs> Destroy everything in is our the emperor he's talking to. Cool. Feed me again. Damn it, he fixed the helmet. I wonder if your thoughts. Feelings for your old master. Damn! I'd say that, yeah. Kenobi means nothing. <laughs> cool! Because he struggles with that, right? 
of Anakin oh, yeah. and being Darth. He goes back and forth. I want my bedroom to look like that. <laughs> <laughs> Bring a girl back on. That. Like what the and I, fuck? And I have that music playing on on loop. <laughs> like I'm gonna die here. <laughs> What's this? It's probably uh, Leia. Yeah. I kind of like it if they ended it with Darth Vader. No, I know, <laughs> I know. Kind of... Damn, she's swaggy as fuck. Cool gloves. Cool. Just like her mama. <laughs> Don't worry, no blasting. Is that a holster? <laughs> yes. And? It's for my snacks. It's Obi. Cool. Uh, so, I mean, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed that too. I was like, didn't you just cry over him? Almost like leaving you? Yeah. <laughs> Don't, you can't leave. She's a kid. Yeah. That thing reminds me of like the robot from Spy Kids. Had the boy Empire hats like, his own little from... robot. And Boulder. Ooh. Let's hope that day never comes. But you would have nightmares. Yeah, seriously. Thank you. Yeah, too young to learn the truth to all that. But we must be careful. No one must know. <clears throat> Aww. Nice. Yeah. That was a good finish to that story. <laughs> cool. Say it to me, Obi Wan. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> it will never be with you. <laughs> he just looks at you, flips you off, and just walks away. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll never be the main character. <laughs> I just realized her robot's in the holster. <laughs> That's yeah. cool. <laughs> Poor guard's gotta wear those helmets. <laughs> so goofy looking. Oh, nice! Look at Obi Wan. <laughs> his robes and everything, I love it. You know what outfit it's I like? Clean. His Clone Wars outfit is so sick mm -hmm. with the armor. You gonna go bring that to Luke? 
Poor Luke, man. He's he's like, what did I do? <laughs> just got chased by his, someone and then knocked down the like rocks. He's leaving. He's knocked out. Where's he going? Then? Well, good thing he looks exactly like a Jedi. That everyone can know. <laughs> I know. And Darth Vader's extra pissed now. <laughs> you beat me twice? <laughs> That's funny. Distance. And I will. Okay. Look, especially after last night. God yeah. damn. He needs now, Owen, is you and Brew. Sounded really good there. Yeah. <laughs> Hello there. Well, he sees um... him. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> Let's go! We're not ready to see. <laughs> Is this full on new like recording? Like they got yeah. him to do that? <laughs> oh, that was cool! <laughs> oh, that's what we needed. Cool. Boom. So. What do you think? Pretty good episode, honestly. Yeah. Um, like I had a lot of stuff I didn't like about it. Oh yeah. But, but when it focused on Obi Wan, Darth Vader, and that aspect, I thought they did a great job. Yeah. But freaking uh, the Reva part plot <laughs> just didn't make sense. No, we could like, be missing something. I don't know because I'm so confused on that front. I don't get it at all. And if we are, I, I just her, the her reasoning for things is just like so back and forth. Like, oh, I'm gonna kill Darth Vader. I'm a, I'm a bad person. I kill people. Oh, mid, mid kidnapping and mid like attempted murder. Yeah. She's like, 
oh, I don't want to do this anymore. And then, then the family just forgives her. And even Obi-Wan's like, it's okay, you can be a better person. It's just like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. She's been killing people and been like just off of this whole season. So that whole mix didn't make sense. And the fact that we had to mix that and use that with this episode during all the freaking it it. Obi Wan. Yeah, it's like mm-hmm. why are we? Why is this part of this episode? Right? Like they should have just honestly, if they killed her, like she died last episode, and we saw none of her plot this episode, and it was yeah. all Obi Wan and Darth Vader. I probably would have gave this like. Like a nine out of ten. Yeah. But because of all that, it's not. It's I. I'm gonna say just it's it's a seven. Like I thought all that shit was cool, yeah. but as an episode as a whole, her not to me it didn't make sense. It didn't connect to me at all. It just felt like why are we focusing on this plot where it didn't really go anywhere? It was just kind of a waste of time mm-hmm. when this show should have just focused on the Obi Wan and Darth Vader aspect all the way through. It's their past. It's their trauma. It's their story. Like, I get it. Reva went through some shit, but not enough to take half of this season and yeah. just make it her story. And if it was well done, I would have been like, cool, new character. The way they added that in was interesting. But it just, my personal opinion, just wasn't done well with her. Like, from start to finish. No, I think I think probably everyone agrees with you. The only thing is, is that the only excuse that I'm thinking up in my head is that she's conflicted. Like, oh, but like the thing is, is that I was trying to use like the, the kind of a, like comparison with like, uh, Darth Vader, like going back and forth between Anakin and Darth Vader, but it's like, it's not her whole plan. It's so different. Yeah. It's her whole plan was to turn on Vader, right? That was the whole point. She gets messed up, stabbed, left on the ground. And then it's like, she's trying to kill Luke for. So in this sense, was it cause she failed? Against Darth Vader, and she's like, "Okay, now I'm back under him, and I have to get his approval. And the only way is to go kill Luke. Like, I don't understand. But you, she's you like, weren't the whole time. Like, this is what she I mean. Did, yeah, when she didn't kill Luke, she's like, "I failed him. Like, what do you mean? You trying to kill the dude? Yeah, and now your you're whole point is to kill him. After like, she literally, she's like trying to murder this family at the middle yeah. of the night. Like, they're fighting for their lives. They're about to take." <laughs> Uh, she's about to take their child away, yes. right? Okay, and then mid, like she like throws Luke, drags him down the rocks, and Luke's knocked out. He looks dead, and then she just she's about to kill him, and then it cuts, and then it goes to her holding his dead. It looks like dead body, yeah. walking up to the family. She's not saying anything. Drops, and she's just like, "Oh, I'm sorry." And then the parents don't even care. They just grab Luke, go away, and then Obi Wan's like, "We forgive you. You're gonna be a better person." Yeah, like it's just. It felt like the it writing was it. off, bro. It felt like there was yeah. two writers. There was one writer for Obi Wan, and then there was one writer for Riva. And it was like, I was extremely confused. And not to say that Obi Wan's writing, like, it wasn't amazing. Don't get me wrong. I still don't think the writing as a whole in this series was very good. But his at least hit the mark. Yeah. Hers the whole time. I was like, there was moments where I'm like, I'm feeling it. I do you know like uh, when you get uncomfortable, like mm-hmm. you're getting secondhand cringe or whatever you want to call it. That's what I was getting. I was like, this is making me very uncomfortable, and I don't know how to re- like react as a normal person in this situation. But let's not just focus on this episode because we got to take our Obi Wan glasses off. Because I know a lot for even for me, just to see Obi Wan be back. Is going to help you watch every episode. You're going to enjoy yourself at some point in the episode. Yeah. But you got to take these things away when doing a review for a whole series. And for me, I had a hard time through the whole series taking off my Obi-Wan glasses and seeing it for what it really was and stuff like that until, like, I'd say, like a day after the episode came out. But to me, there was still a lot of problems with a series. And I also think that for a series with a character that is big as Obi-Wan, that this is like the biggest show you're going to make. Like, I get everyone loves Mandalorian. I love Mandalorian. Trevor loves Mandalorian. This should be way bigger. Boba Fett, it's kind of different because the the mystery of Boba Fett was what made, was what the whole purpose of the show was, right? You could play around with a lot of that. I still don't think uh, Boba Fett came off great. I think it was good between okay and good. This show, it was 
in the same mark as for me. It was like a six, seven out of ten. I would go more to six out of ten. But in my opinion, you can't have an Obi Wan TV show at a six out of ten. You just no. can't. It's just this disrespectful to the fans. To yeah. people who just like forget the fans. People that just like good TV. Like you know, stop using the like hype characters and crazy like from the past that people love and then just using that and just making it underwhelming and just like yeah. teasing us the whole time it's just like focus on a good show with these big characters don't just make the the name of who they are the biggest thing yeah because then we're freaking underwhelmed yeah and that's I, how i feel with this and i feel like a too. lot of the things that were happening in this season too that really kind of it doesn't anger me like in such a way but it's it's frustrating sometimes because it's like i don't like this part this part this part this part and then we'll sprinkle a little thing in that's let's say something that'll grab you from the past right let's let's mm -hmm. say just like let's say qui-gon came in in episode three and i didn't like episode three and they just got through that's kind of like me being like you kicked me in the nuts, but you're throwing me some food after. Like, that's what it feels like, <laughs> right? Like, that's that's what it is. Because, like, there's so many excellent, excellent scenes in this show. And it's like, but they can't hold the show if they're there for 20 seconds. And then the other 95% of the TV show is mid. Like, yeah. at some points, I didn't even, like, I was again, like, I don't care. Right? I don't mm -hmm. care about this. And like, either, but there was, it was most mostly for me. It was like it was a mid show that had some sprinkles of really, really good scenes. I liked how we brought in uh, Hayden Christensen in back to play Darth Vader. That was excellent. Qui Gon throwing him in there at the end. That was fucking awesome. Yeah. But it's like those scenes can't be the only thing to drag this along because no. you have six episodes, and in six episodes you should have been able to get a lot more done and done a lot better at this series and i feel like they've missed the mark on a character that truly was probably the best character and the biggest character you could use for a tv show right now and i feel like they missed the mark and that's a really big and it, opportunity it was missed. set so perfectly for him yeah. his age the way that he was still able to play like this younger obi-wan it's just i like like and i hate compare i keep saying mandalorian but that's like the most recent like best star wars that's a tv thing show yeah yeah and like i can like like forget the story and like be like oh i want to go watch the mandalorian because the episodes are watchable again you can yeah. go back and just have fun watching it the action the how like the star wars world plays out but this i i feel like i'm gonna have to go up on youtube and look up for all the obi-wan and darth vader scenes and then the rest i would i don't want to sit through this shit again it's not i'm not gonna be like this is a classic maybe the fight scenes like the yeah. final fight scene darth vader and obi-wan was I thought it was really well done. I had literally have no complaints with that. Even their like little dialogue, it was sick, and where they fought was cool. But it's just like I, I'm never gonna be like, oh, I'm bored. I'm gonna go watch Obi Wan season oh, one. 100 percent. Never, right? But Mandalorian season two, uh, season one was the only one that out of. And this is kind of sad. Getting a little off topic here. Out of all the Marvel and and um, Star Wars shows that I've watched, I've only gone back to watch Mandalorian once. Yeah, and it's like you're using these characters that should be reeling in people and making every everyone should be exploding with happiness. I want to see like just positive videos, reviews all the way around, and especially for an Obi One thing, it's like I expect it to be the best thing you've ever made, not something that you just kind of gave to. It's like you have Darth Vader, you have Obi One Kenobi. I'm not gonna use Qui Gon because he's in there for like five seconds. You have the Inquisitors, and it's like. You came off at like a six out of ten. How the fuck did you manage that? Yeah. Right? And it's like it was cool to see Leia and Luke as kids. Not the biggest part in my opinion. It's a but there's like a time and a place. Like you had yeah. one series to bring this together and and now it's like now it's like the same old like Disney and everything else where it's like well, I'm excited what's going to happen next. So the next thing's got to be big, right? Yeah. Oh, the next one's going to be better, right? And it's just like can we just like i want to be like forget the future shit i want to watch a series and like keep thinking about it because that's how well done it was but lately yep. it's like okay let's move on and i hope the next thing's good that's how it's making us feel and it sucks yeah let's hope me personally let's, ho let's hope andor and bad batch bring some uh, good shit into the mix because right now uh, boba fett i thought was gonna be great it wasn't 
and uh, Obi Wan. Like I, I enjoyed watching it, but I don't think this would be a series I'm gonna come back to anytime soon. Any last yeah. words? Uh, no, Rocky, not really. Does Rocky have something to say? Rocky, yes. <laughs> <laughs> speak, speak. Nope. So I hope you guys enjoyed that reaction to the series finale of Obi-Wan Kenobi. Uh, uh, from our re review at the end, I think you guys got everything that we wanted to say. Um, mm. It's not something that I think we're going to be going back to anytime soon. Hopefully we got some good Star Wars stuff coming up with uh, Andor in Season 2 of Bad Batch. I don't know if there's any other series that are going to be coming up for it in the recent or anytime soon. So, any last words? I had fun, just disappointed, but... Uh... Yeah, let's move on to the next series. All okay? right. And before we leave, guys, if you could drop a like and subscribe down below, like we said at the beginning of the video, it would be greatly appreciated. We're bringing you episodes of all sorts of TV shows almost every day of the week. And we also got Discord, Twitter, and Instagram down below. Until next time, guys. Hello. See, See you guys. later. enjoyed this reaction to the season finale of uh, series finale of obi-wan kenobi um like yeah. we just gave a review oh, look at me <laughs>